course with my fellow classmates. We are gathered here today to celebrate the ending of our school years with each other. It has been a long 13 years, but they flew by a lot faster than any one of us could imagine. We started out going to elementary school where we befriended more people than we could have ever imagined. We had fun doing anything and and as you all know, the biggest dilemma was what color crown should I use. <laughs> we had homeroom parties that our parents put on, and we played on the playground and let our imaginations run wild. Back then, nothing could stop our dreams, and anything was possible. Middle school days crept up on us as we were just getting used to being the top dogs of our elementary schools. We met new people and again made more friends than we thought we would. Middle school was a scary storm, was a scary concept. We had seven hours of different classes that we had to get to in five minutes, and we had lockers that had code switches. Not only that, but we were also starting to grow up and go through all those awkward stages middle school kids go through. However, just when we started to get comfortable in our middle school routine, along came high school. With two different schools merging into one, associations changed. Cliques had to add more people when groups of friends came to an end. And as people changed and matured, or not, most of us ended up hanging out with people that we never would have expected. But oh me, the memories we were going to make in the next four years were going to be piled up. We had no idea what we were getting into. And just when we finally got the feel of the old high school, we had to go to the new one. We are the last graduate class to have attended the old high school while it was still high school. Those intermediate years of high school flew by, and before we knew it, we were starting our senior year, our final year. Teachers told us we better enjoy it, because before we would know it, it would be our last day. Well, what do you know? Look what we are doing right now, my fellow classmates. Tonight, we graduate. Tonight, we graduate. We are sitting here at graduation in our caps and gowns, getting ready to walk across the stage and get our nice diploma carriers that do not actually have their points in them. But we did it. We finished our school. Though as exciting as graduation is, it also has its sentiment. Now is the time our parents have to let us go and encourage us to start our new journey in this crazy world. I'd like to thank the parents and family of this morning because without you all, who knows where most of us would be today. Our parents start out holding our hands from our day of birth, and they never let go. They love and support, the love and support they take. I would also like to recognize a certain teacher who's not here tonight. Coach Marshall, thank you, Coach Marshall, for always teaching us that no matter what our dreams are, we can reach them if we are determined. He also taught us that we only have a short time to get our lives the way we want them, so we better take the right path. To quote author Ever Garrison, a teacher is a compass that activates the magnets of curiosity, knowledge, and wisdom in the universe. As we grow up, things will change in our lives and we'll end up having to go through situations that we don't quite understand. One of the hardest things to go through is watching loved ones come and go through our lives. One example would be the loss of our classmate, Connor Lizzie. I did not personally know Connor, but I heard many stories about him. I know he was a great guy and inspired many of you here today. As tonight ends our school days with each other, I hope you are able to look back and remember your high school days with me. That you did everything you wanted to and had an amazing experience. People say that high school shouldn't be the best time to our life. But then we hear people spend the rest of their days reminiscing all about their high school colleges. I want you to be able to look back and say, Yes, high school was wonderful, and I made many memories with people I will always have a place in my heart for. 
However, what I want you to know is that your good times don't stop here. When you're 70 years old, I want you to be able to say, I've lived a life I lived, and I'm more than happy where I am now. Chase your dreams, and don't let anybody stop you from doing what you love. Now everybody look to your left. Look to your left. And everybody look to your right. Can you feel that? Yeah. The spirit of being done with high school is in the air tonight. Thanks for all the memories. God bless.